So here we are at the Courtney Museum. This is a book art show by the G.P. Vanier Fine Arts and Creative Writing students. This is the entrance to their show. That's the creative writing class with Ron Wilson and the art class 12 with Heather Thomas. Here are the students' names. They all contributed some just outstanding book art work. So I'm going to make a little movie. Let them know what a great job they did. We'll start, we'll start with this. A rose is a rose is a rose. It's like a, a book object. I think it's a basketball, woodblock print, handwritten, oh, there's her name, Jen. She writes, a rose is a rose is a rose. There it is. There we go. A rose is a rose is a rose. And then she made this, gets a basketball at a thrift shop and then puts this tin can that she wraps with part of the print for the kind of the binding. And then just here, this, it's kind of a, it's a, it's a mysterious piece. It's, it's a suitcase, reminiscent of so many, and this is, he was from Creative Writing, and he, this is his long poem. And his drawing. It's kind of like, what is that? It's not a peace sign, it's an upside down. Oh yeah, here's this thing, at the back. This is the fascist government. Here is like a modified existing book. It's called Listen. I'll try to flip through some of the pages. They're very well done. Oh. I'll just put this on the floor. The designs of the pages are really nice on this one. And these are like transcriptions. I think she downloaded them on the internet off favorite passages of music. Oh yeah, and then she's got these wood type letters here. Oh yeah, hand printed wood type. Oh yeah, the letters go on. Are they in alphabetical order or do they spell something? It's quite mysterious. Here's, here's a fish bowl. There's a fish. She wrote the alphabet along the top. Oh, here's a very uh, beautiful decorated work. It's a silkscreen print, accordion fold. I thought she just had beautiful skills with the color. What I, one thing I thought, I thought, that's about identity. Well, one thing I liked about it, she didn't use her own fingerprint. She says, oh, if I want a fingerprint, I'll just get it off the internet. Oh, you can see it's got a beautiful hardcover binding, a little tie up. This cover of print is very beautifully done. That's the front page. Here's the back. It's a nice bit of screen printing. Campbell soup cans. 
This was a really tough and disturbing work here. You'd be surprised. Like you unfold these things and you see all these little very hostile song lyrics. This one's all about weed and this is like a rap song. It's very uh, beautiful, powerful work. And then it comes in this little uh, bound object binding. This is Day in a Life. It's more of a traditional book. One thing I like about it is, well, the pages are beautifully done. And she's got this uh, clear, the type's done on clear plastic stick on that she's done over top of her painting, a watercolor painting. The one I would like you to see, let's see how nice these are. Uh, when did you see quote from Mother Mother? Well, oh, here's a very mysterious. This is like, oh, you see, it's got this really rough hemp binding. And then, oh, and here's her first paper. And then it tells this mysterious story about prehistoric times. I just love this uh, drawing here. Some kind of myth symbol or mythological. But I like it. It ends. Look at that. She's like got an end paper on there. Beautiful finishing paper. But I think it ends with a picture of a book. Here's air. It's a nice little block print. This is a complicated little story, very in the traditional. It's about a Christian. This person went to uh, Palestine. Did work there. She's like, hmm. Okay, here's button binding, denim. Let's put this on the floor and we'll look at it. Oh yeah, these pages are beautiful, I think. The camera doesn't seem to come in focus too well there. I just think for decorated, decorative pages, they're very powerful. There's a gorgeous use of colors and just so, uh, so little. She always held back, or he always held back. This blank page, ooh, so nice. So, it's like, it's like machine sewn here. It looks like a, just a pant leg. <laughs> it's pretty good. <laughs> 